Hello horror fans, and welcome back to Day by Daylight. In this episode, I'm going to do a challenge where I have to either safely unhook survivors twice or take a protection hit for them in the same match while I'm using the perk We're Gonna Live Forever. So, I use this perk quite a bit. I'm fairly comfortable with it overall. Oh, great. What I'm not comfortable with is being the first one found. But, I guess that's just the way it is. Okay, he's just injuring everybody. So that works out okay. I'm not too upset about that, personally. I'm like, I'm fine being injured because I've got uh, Iron Will, so I'm not going to make any noise. Really? I mean, my whole thing, as I said, is just uh, trying to rescue people. Alright, he is literally just injuring everybody. And the other one, uh, two of the other survivors have med kits with them, so I'm not sure that's a great plan on his part. Not sure what he's going for. Maybe a daily ritual where he has to come out of cloak and hit the survivors. Not positive. It is a different playstyle, I will say that. Pretty sure I saw him over there. Okay, he was way over there. And you know what? I'm gonna go in for the save, if I can. Hopefully he's not just camping. I really need this save, but I'm not gonna get it. Unfortunate. Alright. Oh, okay, they wanna heal me first, that's fine. I will definitely take a protection hit. That was not what we needed right there. Alright. Well, I was about as far away as possible on that one, so... I'll head back to my generator here. He had kicked it. So he did come over here. <clears throat> Hear that or it was uh, Hex Ruin. Nope, he's here. Alright, well... They broke his hook there, doesn't do me a lot of good, but it is what it is. Do really still love these struggle mechanics? That works out fine for me though, I'll take that. Why are you heading after me again? I wasn't the one that just uh, did that to you. Ah! Alright, well somebody finished my generator, so I guess that's a good thing. Do 
have a feeling that uh, he might have something like uh. Never mind. I was thinking he might have uh, devour hope since he was getting away from the hook as quick as he was. But I guess not. I have a feeling he has barbecue and chili. We know he's over there. That's a good thing. really could use this unhook thing. But you know what? It is what it is. I'm like, I want somebody around because I want to take a protection hit for you. disappeared already so yeah he's gonna come after me I'm fairly certain of it Oh, he did not. Interesting. Where was that? was my screw up. You know what? I'll take it. I know he's down this way. I know his generator was also over here.
Alright. I sure get the unhook here. Not the safe unhook. So I have accomplished the challenge at this point, I believe. So I should be good to go with that. this. If he's going to guard that generator some, I'll come on down to this one. I got no issue with that. As I said, I've already accomplished my challenge here, so I'm good. Live or die doesn't really matter. through the window. I'm happy enough about that. Okay, they're running away from the basement. That's alright. I'll get my struggle points here. And I'm alright dying here. As I said, I did get the rescue, which is what I needed. So it worked out well. They can see each other, but they're probably not going to come for me. Hey, they are going to come for me. Alright. appreciate that. I'm like, I just barely got off the hook. And this med kit is used up, evidently. Yeah. Looks like it. Not letting me use it one way or the other. I'm gonna go die working on this, I think. Might as well get the extra points for it.
All right. Well, we got the last generator done, so I guess that's all right for me. Got those at added points. Now I'll probably go die opening the gate, which is fine. Not mind that at all. And did complete the challenge. Nice. And with that, I'll go ahead and claim carrying the team and the epilogue of level one. So as I've said, I'm not really playing that hard on this current tome. I'm not a huge fan of most of the cosmetics. Really, the only one I want is the Trickster's blue outfit. So, feel fairly confident that I'll get there without a problem. But beyond that, I'm not too worried about any of the other stuff. So I'm just playing a little bit to enjoy. And as I said, I'm taking advantage of the double blood point event. So, with that in mind, if you enjoyed what I did in this episode, please go ahead and click that like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, so that you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you. I hope to see you all again in the fog.